Hi, I'm Amelia Hardwick and how I got into metal detecting was with my dad, he's been going for quite a while now but I wanted to join him on a few of the, his digs so I came along on a couple of them and be, every single dig I found something good I've never came back empty handed yet but then on the third dig we went, we, as about afternoon, halfway through we went out, we were starting to get a bit tired, it was a bit late and we found the best thing, the axe horn oh it's an axe horn, we were joking around with all of it and then we pulled it, the first one out and it was the axe head and then we filled it back in, dad told me to fill it in so I filled it back in, it was me, my dad and my granddad and then my dad's gone back over to it and make sure there's nothing else there and as we've gone back over he's got another signal and he started digging, we've seen more just go into a in the hole and then he sent me to go find the owner of the dig, uh, Steve Denton he sent me up to the top of the field to go find him and I didn't know who he was so I've gone sprinting up the top of the field to find Steve and I didn't know who he was so I went up to these random people and asked them they uh, led me to Steve he came over and everyone like all around it couldn't dig or anything and the archaeologist came down, he had to stay there for about three nights protect it and one of the nights night hawkers tried to come on which are people who go in the land to find stuff illegally with no permission. How many artifacts did you find? There were 65 I think in total, not all axe heads, there were some like sword tips, rapier sword tips, just bronze cake which is just a, just a big lump of bronze and just a few other bits and bobs that you just And this bronze. was all from you just finding the axe heads? Yeah and 2.5 metres away was another axe hoard with, there wasn't as many axe heads but like artifacts there was more of yeah so you really got the bug for this and yeah and you're going to carry on uh, hopefully i'll be doing it for a while at the moment we go every sunday and we find i almost find ev like something every dig i don't i think there's been about one maybe two digs where i've came back with nothing but i've still at least got a coin or something good so your dad likes taking you because yeah. we're going to find something usually we travel within about an hour to an hour and, and 45 minutes is within our local area and then every now and then we'll get permission on farm and field. And what do your friends think of what you do? I have a f only a few of them know but the ones that know they didn't quite understand it's hard to explain it to them. They probably know now. Yeah <laughs> they see me a few times on like magazines and stuff. And so what, what kind of kit do you use? I have a little pinpoint in my bag with the RX metal detector it's amazing it goes deep on like coin fast it's really good.